Hi, my name is Jude, and I'm going to do a monologue from Chekhov's play, The Cherry Orchard, um, playing the character Trofimov. Okay. Barbara is afraid that we shall fall in love with each other. Day after day, she never leaves us alone with her narrow mind. She cannot understand that we are above love. To avoid everything petty, everything illusory, everything that stops one from being free and happy. That is the whole meaning and purpose of our lives. Forward. We march on irresistibly towards that bright star which burns far, far before us. For Don't try, comrades. All of Russia is our garden, the earth. It is beautiful, it is full of wonderful places. Then Ganya. Your grandfather, your great grandfather, and all of your ancestors were surf owners, owners of living souls. Do not human spirits look out at you from every tree in the orchard? I mean, from every leaf and every stem, do you not hear human voices? Oh, it is terrible. Your orchard, it frightens me. It's like when I walk through it. On an evening or at night, the rugged bark on the trees, it glows with this dim light. And the cherry trees, they seem to see all that happened 100, 200 years ago in painful and oppressive dreams. Well, we have fallen at least 200 years behind the times and we have achieved nothing, nothing at all as yet. We haven't made up our mind about where we stand with the past. We only philosophize, complain of boredom or drink vodka. It is so plain that before we can live in the present, we must first redeem the past and have done with it. And it is only by hard work that that can be done. Only by strenuous, unremitting toil. If you have your household keys, throw them in the bell. Be three. Be three as the wind. Believe what I say, Anya. Believe what I say. You know? I'm not 30 yet. I'm still young. Still a student. But what I have been through, I am hungry as the winter. I am sick, anxious, poor as a beggar. Fate has tossed me hither and thither. I have been everywhere. Everywhere. But wherever I have been, every minute, day and night, my mind and soul has been full of mysterious anticipations. I feel the approach of happiness, Anya.
I see it coming. 